I have a crippling fear of jail. You do? Mm-hmm. Why? Um, partially because I'm black. And everyone makes it seem like it's just like, I'm going to at least go to a holding cell or something at least once in my life. And I was first all the way through the whole heat. I mean, through the whole first 300. And then the monkey got on my back because I didn't stretch or anything. And it's crazy because like, usually on that last hundred, like I get tunnel vision and I don't hear anything. Hmm. And I started feeling like I was running backwards and like three people, uh, four people passed me actually. And all I heard my brother say was, hold your form, lift your knees. And I did that and I just started catching up. But I, and my mom was like explaining to him that he can't reverse this because he was like really mad at her. And um, honestly, like that fucked me up. Like I was really sad when my little brother left. Um, man, I was. When he was gone for like three weeks, because he didn't want to, he thought he was going to get in trouble. He had did some shit at school. Um, I was like so worried about him and I had thought he died. Bro, <laughs> when I was, when I was young, I was so like insecure. I would play the most insecure person to where like I was conceited. Like I was a asshole, bro. Like. When I would walk through the door and somebody's coming, instead of being like, excuse me, I'd be like, excuse you. Like, I would tell people, excuse you. If you could call someone, could be anybody, someone that you've lost touch with, I can magically find their phone number right now, we can give them a ring, and you have 60 seconds to tell them anything you want, Ooh. but then you can never talk to them again. Whoa. Who would you call and what would you say? 